Hello guys, this is Christine and welcome to another video. I'm sorry that recently I haven't posted a lot of videos because I've been busy with my research project. I'm doing a research about cancer cells. It's really interesting but it's really stressful and overwhelming right now. So that's why I kind of like busy with my school work that that's why I didn't really post a lot of videos. But today my video topic gonna be about that everyone have different masks through their daily life. So the mask I'm talking about is not I'm not saying about people who have two faces that they acting differently. Um, like a person who do not like another one trying and pretending to be to like like that person or another person that not happy with their relationship and pretending to love um, their um, their partner just just to have some benefits so those people I'm not talking about in this video those people for me maybe considering that's fake people so the mask I'm talking about in the mask that we have all of us do have different masks that we put on in our daily life depending on different situation different people that we interacting with or just for different purpose that we want so there's so many reasons why we put a mask on especially in our modern life and all the other modern society that um, the social media tend to make us have to put on a mask to show the world that we are a good person and especially that um, nowadays when you go for a job interview or you go for a school interview for application those people who interview you may look at your social media just to see who are you in real life and who are you just interacting with other people in your real life so because of that reasons a lot of people tend to put on a really perfect mask to have a really positive public image to show the world that they are a good person another reason is that um, uh, when we face different situations we have to put on different masks so for example if you are hanging out with your friends you want to put on a mask that just like choking hanging out relaxing but when you go for a job interview you cannot put those masks on you have to put on a professional um, mask or really nice person mask that gives you a higher chance to get a job um, or depending on different people that you're interacting with maybe when you're interacting with your friends you'll be more comfortable or when you're interacting with your related member you'll be like kind of like a good girl or a good boy or um, if you are interacting with a stranger will be you will act differently also so it depends on the people who you are interacting with and um, also I think one thing that's really really common is that a lot of people tend to put the mask on just because they want to hide the witness so how many times do you see um, people that go through just go through a breakup in the relationship where people just just lose their loved one and they pretending that they are per, uh, that they are fine that they are okay and everything is normal when they have to go to school and they have to show up at work or some people who even do customer service they do have to like care about their customer smile a lot of time and pretending to be happy so those are different masks that we want to put on put on to show that everything is fine everything's okay you just want to hide your um, vulnerability and also your witness and or simply some people just want to have the privacy and the com and the comfort zone they don't want to show the world show everyone that they have they are a different person so there are so many masks that we put on every day so what do you think that are these masks good for us should we put them on or should we take it off for me i do think that the mask have different function that we do need to put it on to help us effectively go through life and to help us uh, face different circumstances different situation and we, when we interacting with different people so the mask is important for us to put on but do not overuse it because some people I know some people just overuse their emotional mask they just if and this really common if you are a guy or if you are a man you want to show that you brave that you're strong that you are not emotional that you you are really like 
you're not crying. So especially when you show that to a female, to your uh, family members, or to your girlfriends, or to your wives, you tend to be like a strong person, or especially to the kids. So. <clears throat> If you overuse this mask, you try to put a mask on and hide your anger or hide your emotions, hide all your feelings, one day it will explode. So do not overuse it. Sometimes you need to see the right person or be with yourself, express all of your emotions and be yourself. So it's kind of really conflict because in this in our modern in our modern life, a lot of time we will hear that be ourselves, express ourselves, be yourself. But at the same time, we do have to put on different masks to go through different situations with different people. So what do you think about this? So, and I I also see some people that they put on the mask and they lose their self. They don't even know really who they are. Or some people they don't, they couldn't even really find who they actually are. And some people even scared and afraid of facing with um, their real, the real face. So what do you think about this? Should we put the mask on or should we just express ourselves as who we are? So yeah, so this is the topic I want to talk about today. Uh, thank you so much for watching the video and have a nice weekend.